Hey, it's Mr. Beyblade 21 here, and uh, uh, I'm gonna make a quick. Well, I'm gonna try to make it as quick as I can. Quick Skylanders collection video. I haven't made one in a while, and now that we got our game capture, I I thought let's make a virtual collection. So uh, here, let's start out with Ninja Stealth Elf. Um, this character, uh, very uh, mobile. I'm just gonna quickly show you all the moves. So we got main attack combo. Combo one, combo one, combo two, and combo, combo, combo three. Why isn't it working? Right there, there is combo three. And then it has the triangle, the jump, and my favorite part, the tiger. So there's Stealth Elf. Moving on. Mm, next we have, um... Lightcore Eruptor, a uh, very cool guy. So there he is. Footprints shoots these. His triangle is these little fireballs, and his circle does this. It's called a Revenge of Prometheus. Very effective move. There is Eruptor. Moving on, we have uh, a Series One Dark Spyro. A uh, pretty uh, special Skylander. So we got the normal fire attacks right here. We have the horns where he rams. Boom, 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 which I guess lasts like a very long time. Then he can take flight. And when once he takes flight, he can shoot fireballs from the air. And he can also mash the ground. So there's Dark Spyro. Next we have Lightcore Hex, which you got for free if you pre-ordered Skylander Swap Force, which I did. So I picked her up this way. She, I actually thought I actually thought I wasn't gonna like her, but she's really cool. So there's her normal attack. Then here's her circle. By the way, I'm playing on PS3. So there's her circle. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, you didn't see it because they all attack these. I'm going to stay over here. So here's our circle. Here we go. All right. Almost there. Oh. Bang. Boom, boom, boom. Then she has this shield thing. Shield of bones. Very cool, very powerful, very dangerous. Oh, no. All right. Moving on. We have uh, Little S's favorite Skylander for uh, no apparent reason. Series 1 Jetvac. It's got this thing. Air blade thing. Then it's got this little vacuum. And when you shoot the vacuum, that didn't work. So when you suck up air. Okay, there's some... You can make it shoot fire shot somehow. Anyway, you have the take flight thing. You can like shoot while you take flight. Then you can suck in to get all your air back. There's a way to make you shoot like super air bullets. No idea how to do it. But anyway, there's Jetvac. Moving on. We have a uh, Series 2 Whirlwind. Whirlwind, yes. Very cool. So we got this weird thundercloud move. Then we have the rainbow move, and the thing that I love about this rainbow move, that it heals. Oh, do you guys see that? Watch. When you shoot the rain cloud, it like explodes into like a million. Little rainbows. If I can do it. Okay. I'm gonna try. It should work. Alright, I give up. Anyway, yeah, there's the rainbow move. What I like is that if you shoot another Skylander with this rainbow, say if you're playing co-op, you heal him. Also, it can take flight. Shoot these. Also do that. Um, my uh, other move that I like to do, you hold down her main attack, and it shoots this weird uh, no rainbow supernova thing. So that's really cool. Moving on. We have Series 2. Cinder. And by the way, these are n in no particular order. I'm just picking them up and putting them on the portal of power. So Cinder can also take flight. 
And uh, when she does, she can call down this lightning storm. Very cool. She also has this lightning power. That's her main attack. Her secondary attack is this thing. She travels like under and these ghost things attack her. Attack them. Like, like so. That was very cool. Moving on, we have Series 2 Prism Break. This guy's a very cool Skylander. Now, he has, obviously, this move, Normal Prism. And you can also make it so uh, it like, I don't know, just watch. Do you, I don't know if you see that, but I'm like shooting, shooting something. I'm like firing a charge down there. So yeah, that's happening. Also, we can bring down the prisms in here. If you can, you can even like do multiple prisms like that. So that's that, and I'm attacking three of the little things at once. Then you can also jump like that and make that happen. Boom. Series 2 Prison Bait. Next, we got one of my favorite Skylanders. Series 2 Trigger Happy. Now he can shoot these things. He can also hold it down a bit. Shoot a little bigger coin. He can also hold it a little bit more. Shoot an even bigger coin. He can hold it even more. Shoot a larger coin with more damage. And then he can shoot it like so it's really big and like do a lot of damage like that. And then he like goes flying back. He can also shoot these pots of gold. And he's got this machine gun which you can fire like a like a large shot I guess and the thing I like about this is that it's unlimited don't stop till you drop you know what I mean so there's trigger happy moving on we have a uh, pop fizz series one so he has the orange potion he also has the purple potion, which makes the little babies. And then he also has the green potion, which is the one I like to use, which makes the puddles of acid. Then he can also shake them all and make a big explosion, which is very cool. And then when he drinks something, it turns all crazy. And oh, I drink it. it. Turns all crazy, and he can like attack, and he can like breathe fire. Depending on depending on which potion you drink, you get a different ability. Yeah, that's better. So there's Pop Do Fuse. Moving along, we have this guy, Slobbertooth. Sadly, the only Skylander I don't have all the moves for. Maybe I can go buy a move right now, but I'm not gonna. So I guess he has this attack, main attack. Then he has this thing where he bites you. Then he has the stop. There's Slobbertooth. Next we have... Not... No. No. Yeah, okay, there we go. Straight to the Popthorn. Came with a Tower of Time adventure pack. So he has this move where he breathes a lot of whatever. And on your first one, you do a big one. But it also has this, which is like literally awesome. Literally the coolest thing in the world. And uh, he also has this. He can jump. And if you hold it down, he can do three big jumps. And then also, uh, I'm just going to add another thing to him. I also have this thing called the Sky Diamond, which is really good for uh, making fast money, as you will now see. Look at my money, it's at about 9,000. And it's like rapidly going up. I don't know if you see that. Bottom left, it's going up very fast. And at the left side of the screen, you can see the Sky Diamond is slowly going down. So once that runs out, you can stop making money. But 
right now I just gained like a thousand bucks that easily. So it was very cool. Very awesome way to make money. Very fast and efficient way. I know some people bought like several of the adventure packs so they could get a lot of sky diamonds because unfortunately once you use it once you have to like leave the main area then come back in order to be able to use it. So yeah, see I just gained a bunch of money just like that. Next we have... Here we go. Series 2 Zook. Or Zook. So, he has the missile, and if you actually hold it down, it goes farther. See how if I stop there, you can see the explosion? Here, I'll demonstrate that way. No, not that way. This way. Stops right there. If I hold it down, it'll keep going. And I don't know if you saw the explosion way in the back. See? Stops there. Goes all the way back there. Also has these mushrooms for some protection. And then he's got the little... Little... Um, what should I call it? Pineapple bazooka. And I can aim where I wanted him to shoot. Cause like a bows. All right. Oh, and for the swap force characters, I'm not going to show you every combination. Probably the fastest Skylander, NA. Flame Slinger Series 2. So, first of all, he's got these arrows that he shoots. Bang, boom. He's also got this, like, sky volley. Then he has this. This is his little, like, really, like, really fast mode. And then... He doesn't stop there. He can go from that... All the way... To this. Stop there? Go even faster! Like... Like, lyrics are coming at you at supersonic speed. Like... This guy coming at you, you have... Like... Like, no idea what hit you. And uh, along with... Flame Slinger, I might as well just show this because, um, you know, whatever. We have the Battle Hammer, also came with the, the Tower of Time. It pretty much just hammers and does an incredible amount of damage. And not only does the hammer get hit, he is also still shooting his arrows. So you're doing, when you put this on, you're doing an incredible, like, extraordinary amount of damage. It's just amazing. Moving on. We have Series 2 Terrafin. Chomp Chomp. He does not have the big claw things because that is not the path I chose. But anyway, here's the one combo he has with the mo path I chose. But now with the path I chose, he has this metal thing. So he can do that. He can belly flop. He can also do this dive back into the ground which still does damage then he can also while he's in the ground no, while he's in the ground fire these little mini mini sharks which you can also fire above land but they're really like useless next we have one of my favorite normal skylanders uh, series 2 Lightning Rod. Uh, I like to call him Zeus. So, first he's got his Lightning Bolt. Here, I'm gonna come over here. Got his Lightning Bolt. Then he's got his Held Down Lightning Bolt. Which does even more damage. Then he has this thing. What the heck? Whoa. That's so weird. I didn't know you could do that. Boom. Ow. Oh, the sheep turn big when you electrocute them. That's so cool. That's so weird. <laughs> okay, but yeah, he has this where all surrounding enemies get electrocuted. Then he has this move. Where he turns into like a big Zeus. And he electrocutes things. 
So there is a lightning road. Then there's this man. Uh, series 2 drill sergeant. Beep boop bop. He has this thing where he fires his rockets. And they actually turn into mini rockets if you see that. Or if he's like up close to an enemy, he'll just hit him. Then he also has this thing, this laser thing. Now, when I'm playing with Drill Sergeant, I'm just holding down triangle. So his laser is firing even when I'm shooting my thing. Then he also has this charge. So yeah, he has this better thing. That's Drill Sergeant for you. Moving on, we got... We got, uh... <laughs> Slam bam! There he is. Pretty, uh, pretty, pretty big guy. So he's got this thing. His combo. Boom, boom. Oh, bang, bang. Here we go. Boom. Enormous amount of damage. Then he can freeze his enemies in a like a thing of ice. So if there's an enemy there, they get frozen. Let's see if we can freeze the sheep. Yeah, I just froze the sheep. And see, I'm free. I just froze this mi minion thing, and he still took damage. And then he also has this sled, Bob sled, Bob sled, whatever you call it. So that's Slam Bam. Moving on to okay. Let's see. Should we do? We'll do the Swap Force characters before the Giants. We have this guy, Washbuckler, which I've yet to find his like mystery move or what you call it. But anyway, he has his sword, which he can hold down and do some damage. Then he has his gun, which has piranhas in it. He can also hold it down and shoot too. Then he can do this, this little thing, and my favorite, he can like constantly hit it for a lot of damage. So that's Washbuckler. Then we got... Oh crap. Swap Force character just broke. If you know what I mean. We have... Magna Charge. So he's got his little gun thing, which is really awesome. It does have to re cool down, but while it's cooling down, it like shoots a rocket anyway. So who doesn't want that? Very awesome gun. He also has this move, where it like grabs something, throws it. Now basically, when I find an enemy that I really don't feel like fighting, because I play on hard, I literally just lift him up with Magna Charge's ability, and throw him off the map. Kind of cheating, not really. And then he also has this like super speed. Where he can also grab up people and you know get huge. So let's magna charge. Next we got but 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 <laughs> but blast zone. This guy's a really cool guy, all right? I mean, I'd recommend him. So he throws his little his bombs. He can also hold it down to make a sticky bomb. Some text. Boom. Then he also has this little ring of fire, and when you complete the ring, it makes an explosion. Going down, down, down to the burning ring of fire. Anyway, then he has this like charge thing where he can go, and he like just flies around, and he has this little shield for a little amount of time. Anyway, that is Blaze Zone. Then our final swap force character. We have dun, 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 Night Shift. Roll with the punches. I really only got him for one reason. So anyway, here's his punches. Oh, and also thing cool about him, which I can't demonstrate right now, is when he dies, he gets another life, which is really cool. But the reason I got him is really just because of this move, which I think is really cool. And also he can teleport, which is also really cool. Then he bites enemies with his vampire fang teeth. And I guess he gains health. Yeah, I guess, yeah, you gain health when you bite people. 
I, I was unaware of that up until right now. So that was Night Shift. Moving on to the Giants. We are going to start off with the classic Tree Rex. Be afraid of the bark, my friend. So he first has this move. That, that's just jumping. That's not a move. He has this little slam. Then he has this big slam. Then he has this photosynthesis ray. He can also just rapidly shoot his photo photosynthesis ray. Then he can charge. Make him run fast since he's like the slowest, slowest thing in the world. Next we have Hothead. I'm on fire! Alright. So he has this flamethrower thing. Very cool. I mean, see, the thing is, I really wanted to go with this flamethrower path because then he could, um, he could, whatever. Yeah, he could, uh, shoot it for forever. But I find that I used this move, which I'll show you in a second. Oh yeah, here's his oil, which he can light on fire. I used this move far more than I used, um, whatever. His flamethrower, which he can also do that when he does this. Spin around and shoot oil. Then, we also got... No, that's the wrong thing. This move turns into a motorcycle. I actually think this is really cool. Then he has my favorite move this one where he like throws the entire sun for miraculous damage that's hothead next we got probably one of my favorite giants I'm not gonna lie he's awesome so here he's got his hammer combo one right here which he can also shoot those things. But here's combo one, where he slams it. Combo two, where he's oh, whoa, 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 where he throws his hammer. Combo three, he spins around. Then he can also tear apart and like control his things himself, which is really cool. <laughs> then he can also like do down or uh, turn enemies to stone, like Medusa, like that, which is very cool. Let's see if it works on sheep. <laughs> Everything works on sheep. Yeah, of course it works on sheep. So there's that. There's Crusher. Next we have. Uh, really? We have my good old friend Swarm. Bring the sting. I love his accent. So he's got these little attacks. Then he also has this held down attack. Then he also has this thing. Where he can shoot oh he can shoot stingers. And then he can also shoot his main attack. And then he can also no. Turn into a swarm. Where he can become like wield like throw an axe. Which you just saw, or he can like do a big burst, which is very cool. So that's Swarm. But before I take him off, I'm just gonna show you this. This is the Tower of Time, obviously from the Tower of Time Adventure Pack. And it makes it just like rain rocks, pretty much, and do a lot of damage. There's the Tower of Time over there. Let's take both these guys off. Next, we got my man, my first giant besides Tree Rex, Bouncer. You gotta deal with the deal. So I really like him because he can sh shoot these things like super fast, and if you like hold him down, he can shoot a lot faster. Then he has this laser eye thing, which can overheat, but. Either way. Then he can also shoot these rockets. And he can also... I believe you can aim where to shoot the rocket. Yeah. Like, I'll aim at those things. Oh, I just aimed everywhere. 
then he can also, I believe, I believe he has another move. Oh yeah, there they are. He can shoot those fists. Bang. Moving on. We have Thumpback, which at the time was like nearly impossible to get. So I called like hundreds of game stops trying to get it. Finally, one of them had it. So there's, yeah, there's a combo. Combo one, spins. Oh, well, there's that thing. And then he can also let out like a big snorkel. There's combo two, where he like just swings his man. Then here's combo three, the reason I chose this path. Because I really thought that Whirlpool was really cool. Which it is. Almost done, guys. Don't worry. Then, we have... I've got my eye. Eye Brawl, which was also very hard to get. My mom happened to go to Atlanta on a business trip. And I called a GameStop near her hotel, and they had it. So I was like, hey, go get this. So here's... Eyebrow. Very cool. <laughs> then he has these laser things. Oh yeah, let's shoot those. Shoot those. Bang, 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 bang. <laughs> then he has this move where he's like, oh, not that. Unleashes his babies. There we are. Finally, last but definitely not least, we have... Uh, uh, not Ninjini, alright? Sadly. Scarlet Ninjini, alright? You understand what I'm saying? I thought it was very cool when I found this. This person had Scarlet Ninjini in their hand. And I followed them, and then they put it back miraculously, and then I bought it. So yeah, here's combo one. That little spin. Combo two. Throws it, and it keeps attacking. Combo three. She throws it. Let's do that again so you can see. Oh, I guess we're not doing that. Here is this thing where she shoots rockets from her lap. And then there's this one where she like does that from her lap. But here's that one third combo where she throws her little sword. And then finally, last and yes, probably the least because she's useless. We have the sidekick mini genie. Now, it's not like you can only use her on Ninjini. You can use her with any Skylander and she just follows you. So that's fun. I guess she doesn't follow you. Oh, there she is. Yeah, she's kind of slow. So if you go far, she will teleport to you again. Which is dumb. Like, why does she have to be so slow? Like, here she's going to teleport to me. Whatever, fine. She can go kill herself. Oh, no, there she is. So, yeah. That was the final Skylander. Scarlet Ninjini. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you guys liked this video. Uh, please comment on, like, kind of videos you want to see. What kind of gameplays you want to see. Like, favorite, subscribe. And, uh, well, subscribe is most important. But please, please share these videos with your friends. Because that really helps. That builds like a better community, better people. So I uh, hope you enjoyed this video.